Hey there, retro game fans. Today we're gonna play Scramble from Atari Age. Ooh. This is an awesome brand new homebrew for your Atari 2600 uh, based on a classic arcade game. Uh, I, I love it, it's fantastic. I can't wait to show it to you guys. Uh, let's open up the box, take a look at what's inside, and then we will uh, give the game a spin. Now, what's cool about this game is this was a port of an original 1980s arcade game. Um, but this version here actually came out from Atari Age in 2017. So this is a brand new Atari 2600 game. Um, it was just recently released, and it's fantastic. Um, first of all, if you just take a look at the packaging, the packaging on these games that Atari Age uh, produces, this is just as good, if not better, uh, than a lot of the games you got originally in the 80s. Um, let's take a look and open up inside, and you'll see some of the things that it comes with. So, first of all, first of all, we have the cartridge. And again, this feels exactly like a cartridge that you would remember from uh, the late 70s, early 80s from your Atari 2600. All full, co full color. Um, the labels and everything are extremely high quality. Uh, this one has a nice, cool comic book slash instruction manual for it. Um, and again, it gives you an overview of the story. And, and it kind of even says Scramble Force. If you remember, the original Atari um, comic books were called Atari Force. So I'm sure that's kind of like a play into that. But then, of course, it goes into controls and scoring. Gives you even more backstory. And, uh, you know, again, it's just so nicely done. So the other thing that was kind of cool is the uh, original release of Scramble from Atari Age also came with this cool fold-out poster that again, if you remember a lot of the uh, uh, games in the 80s used to always come with similar things like this. And it was just nice that the guys from Atari Age included something like this in the packaging. The guys um, at Atari Age and developers Champ Games um, have done a fantastic job with this game. So let's, uh, let's go plug this into the Atari 2600 and fire it up. So we've got our Atari 2600, we've got our scramble cartridge. Let's take a look and see what we've got. All right, so we are in the game. Now, um, if you guys have never played Scramble before on any system, first of all, shame on you because it is a great, great classic game. The objective is basically very simple. Uh, blow up a ton of crap and don't run out of fuel. Um, as you can see, I am currently shooting a ton of crap, and I've got my fuel gauge um, across the bottom. Every time I shoot one of those little fuel tanks with the F on it, my fuel goes up, as you saw right there. And uh, yeah, the really the objective is here, blow up lots of stuff and don't die. So we will continue to do that. What's great about this game, too, on the Atari 2600 is, is first of all, you just kind of remind yourself that, that, that you're looking at a game that's that's coming out of the Atari 2600, and, and it's a pretty impressive feat. Um, it just looks so cool. I mean, when you think about all the games that came out, you know, um, during the 2600 heyday, you really didn't have games that looked like this, and the advancements that have been made are just, just amazing. The other thing that's cool about this homebrew is um, the game is actually coded to take advantage of a, a controller that has two buttons, like the Sega Genesis control pad. So when you plug one of those controllers into it, it automatically knows that you have a, a controller with two buttons. And one button does the bombs, and one button does uh, uh, your, your forward-facing cannon. Yeah, I am... This is a hard level. All right, so this level here... Oh man, this this one's oh, this one's gonna stress me out. All right, must concentrate on these evil fireballs. Oh my god, I hate everybody at Atari Age right now. Albert and all the guys at Champ Games, hope you're watching this and know that you're giving me a heart attack. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, 
thank God. Okay. I don't believe in God, but whatever. Whew! Alright, we made it through there. I love these building levels. These are probably some of my favorite levels uh, in, in the arcade game. Oh my god, I almost died. Must get fuel tanks. Again, it's just, you know, it amazes me just sitting here thinking about, like, man, I'm playing this on an Atari 2600. And, and the games that Atari H have been putting out lately just keep getting better and better. You can even get the, uh, if you remember the Secret Super Cobra, um, that's also available as well. Just as good as this version. In fact, I'd probably recommend buying both. Because that's what I did. Make it as far as we can here, and we'll probably uh, call this one quits. Hoping I can at least make it to the base. Oh my god. I, I'm one of those people, I, I love video games, and I'm okay at them, but you know, I'm, I'm not an expert game player. Like, you're not going to see me doing speed runs or, or beating like Billy Mitchell's high score or anything like that. But, but I love games, and, and I love playing them, and I love admitting that I kind of suck at them, but look at me go. Alright, so this level here, let's see. This one's trickier to pull off, you really have to watch the shape of the building. So, for example, this one I have to pull back, and I have to come forward again, pull back again. It's really, really tight, tight corridors. Forward, and then back. Oh, no, 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 no. Forward, back. Oh, my God. This is... This is... Str oh, come on. I hate you, Atari Age. I hate you guys. I want you all to be in my ship and die when I crash. Not really. Maybe. All right, come on. Down, down, down. Oh, son of a... Okay, I know I don't suck that bad. I can do this. Maybe I do suck that bad. I probably do. Okay. Careful. Down. Forward. Back. Forward. And then... Holy crap. Oh, I can make this forward. Back. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Made it forward. Back again. And up. Up, yes! Down, and... Oh, crap! Son of a bitch! I hate you guys. And up, 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 up. Alright, here we go. Come on, let's bomb the base. Let's do this! And... Oh, come on! You've got to be kidding me! Alright, let's come back around again. Come on. We can do it! Oh, it's going to miss. That's that's not going to do it. Alright, timing has to be just perfect on this one. It's so annoying. I know, I know. My Do we get it? Oh, crap! Oh, come on. Oh, you gotta be... Oh! And they're... Okay. Alright, we can do this. Atari Age, do not let me down. Not even close, man. Okay. It's gotta be just right now. Oh, you, oh, come on! Oh, that was right there. Okay, ready, and now! What the hell? Okay, let me try another method. Let's get in closer, and... Bombs away! There we go. Congratulations! Alright. Whew! I am spent. Such an awesome game. Um, I highly recommend picking up this and Super Cobra at Atari Age. Um, man, I, I, uh, I can't say enough good things about this. So, pick it up, buy it for your Atari 2600, uh, you'll love it. And uh, thanks everybody for watching.